No, I am not crazy. You want to keep it down? We've had kind of a bad day. I want an explanation. Egan, come here. Why don't you go with Egan? Show him my office, huh? Be my play. Oh, you have a great time with Egan. Go. Come on. Don't bite yeah. him. He'll be fine. Let's go. Did you really drive to a crime scene with Adam in the back seat of your car? Look, you don't understand what happened, all right? Did you leave him alone and unprotected in the back seat of your car while you engaged in a shootout with two heavily armed men? It was an intentional hell, all right? Then what the hell was it? I got a 1013. They called for backup. I was in the area. And it was instinct. Instinct? What about your instinct as a mother, the one that says you don't risk the life of your seven-year-old son? I wasn't thinking. That's it? You pull a stunt like this and all you can say is you weren't thinking? Look, you know, I've, I've been upset and I, I got a little confused and I, I forgot he, I forgot he was in the How car. could you forget? He could be dead right now because of you. Do you understand that? Adam could be dead. I know. I know I made a mistake. I was wrong. Oh, God, Al, what did I do? What did I always do to my little boy? <laughs> Thanks. Uh -huh. You know, sometimes I think that we get so used to loving somebody the way they are, we have a hard time adjusting when they change. I'm just not so sure the changes my wife is going through are healthy ones. Well, sweetheart, if you think you are right about this post-traumatic syndrome thing, then maybe you should encourage Margot to go to a psychiatrist. Already done that. See, she's supposed to be seeing one. She just keeps resisting it. <sighs> maybe she just needs to catch her breath. And this thing will go away all by itself? Well, it's not like she doesn't have a reason to be stressed. I mean plane crash and the publicity and the new job is not enough to stress anybody out. Honey, Maru has been through worse and she's made it. I, I think she can, she can make it through this. Well, let's hope her husband can hold himself together. Then. Oh, her husband's going to be just fine. <laughs> okay, she's probably at home right now. Wondering where I am, right? Mm. house. We're not able to come to the phone right now. Leave your name and number after you hear the beep, and we'll get back to you. Hi, baby, it's me. You there, honey? Hey, Margo? Come on, sweetie. Uh, if you're there, would you pick up, please? I'm not saying that you did it on purpose, Margo. I mean, we all know how the adrenaline gets flowing when we get a call. Oh, no, no, you're right, you're right. You have every right to be mad at me about Adam. It's not just Adam I'm worried about. Well, don't worry about me. I can take care of myself. You are trying way too hard. You got promoted. Do you remember? You don't have to take 1013s anymore. It's my training. I was the closest to the scene. I don't think I'm getting through to you. You don't have to be superwoman. Yeah, I do. I do. See, I got a problem with Adam's father. He thinks I'm losing it, and I got to prove that I am. Oh, Marco. I am not the enemy. Oh, I know, but you've been making some real scary... scary noises. I'm concerned about you, Mark. Come on. Come on, you know me. I mean, the last thing I want to do is interfere in your life. The last thing I want to do never, is make waves. You've never done that. But when you do something like this, it's something really dangerous, Margo. You can't expect me to let it slide. I know you want to help me. I think you need some help. I gotta tell you, at this point, I think you're right. Hey, it's Detective, I mean, uh, Lieutenant Hughes here. The Chief? Yeah, she's right in there. My God. 
I'll help you, Margo. I mean, anything you need. I'll she doesn't need your help. Just ask me. Tom, I was just telling Margo. No, no, she Margo. doesn't need your help. She doesn't need anybody's help. She'll be fine if everybody just leaves her alone. She's under a lot of stress. She doesn't need you making it worse, all right? Tom, hell's right. He has been right all along. And, and so have you. Um, okay, you can back up for me. After what happened tonight, I realized that I, I do need professional help. What happened tonight? Daddy. Hey, surprised to see you here. Are you okay? You all right? 